Hello. It's me again. That's all I got, folks. That's it. Hi. It's me. I'm here. Come here, Randall. Come here. Come on. Try to get Randall to jump up here. He's trying to teach me a trick. Come here. Come here. Jump up here. Come here. Come on. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. This is my co star, Traded Mom in. Yep. Here he is. I traded her in. <laughs> got this her one. In. Yep, traded her in for him. <coughs> it's okay. Look at the camera, dude. He's just look how cute he is. Just look how cool he is. What's the matter, babe? I traded um, her in, so. Randall right, said, welcome to the straw from afar. Hey, we're, we're trying here, okay? No, hello, this is... Yeah, yeah, oh, Go, let's hello. This is RJ with the Straw Family Farm. This is Randall. He's with the Sniffing Depart Factory. Go right on into it. Do the whole thing. Right, well, Don't forget the crochet. What's next? In the chapel. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. Hey, I get my Bible verse. So I don't have to do anything? Oh, of course you do. Of I need to do. What do I have to do? All right. Luke 11, 28. Blessed, rather, are those who hear the word of God and keep it. Randall, you got to stay on the camera, man. You need to be up here. Yeah. Okay, but you're like you're six feet away from him, so you have to put on your mask. Oh, I'm supposed to wear a mask? Oh, your mask. For, uh. You're closer to your co-star than this. <laughs> I can't see anything out of my mask. How does this work? <laughs> it's not working for me, folks. Okay, take it off. Oh, good. Ah! Oh, my co-star left. All right. I need another co-star. Hey, Winnie, come on. You're up next. All right. So here we go. Minnie, Minnie, Minnie you going to get up? It's almost time for her to eat, so. Yeah. Oh, we still got an hour. Yeah. One co-star left. Dirty one co-star. Yeah. One co-star left. One co-star is on a strike until she eats. So... I guess that leaves you. With me. Yep, that leaves you. Okay. Hey, don't so, take my drink. Don't take mine. <laughs> All right. So you did in the chapel. Yep. Okay. In the barn stalls. Next. All right. So Minnie's still in here, right? Minnie, Minnie. You can come over here. She actually goes in and out the door like a dog. Mm. Yep. I if let... she gets mad if you leave her. But not if you put Randall out there with her. Right. But if you leave her by herself, she gets pissed off at you. I mean, just mad. Yeah, she does. She'll get very angry. Um, I put her out in her pen and went to mowing, and she was furious. Like, running at you, acting like she's going to charge you. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Because she's all of, like, 45. I can scoop her up in my arms and just carry her. So, she's not very heavy, is she? Nope. Mini, mini! But she just got to love that face. All right. So, also, we had... Another baby, right? Yep. A couple of sheep have had babies since we last podcast. I don't know where we left off and left on. Um, we'll get to that in, in the... A week or two. Part. Yeah, I don't know when we last did. Um, so, anything else in the barn stalls? Star's doing awesome, right? Yeah. Name all the horses you got out there. Whiskey is off being trained to do barrels, and she's doing amazing, correct? Uh -huh. She's with yep. your girlfriend. Those are, I got jelly bean, I got old pint, I got counterfeit, I got coop, I got prairie dog, I got ice, I got star, I got Sadie, I got Caballo, and then Homer and Charlie. Yep, a dozen horses around this place, huh? I think I only killed off 11 names. <laughs> no. I think there's 12. Hang on. Jelly bean. Paint. Paint. Counterfeit. Coop. Prairie dog. Star. Ice. Cavallo. Cavallo. Sadie. Sadie. Homer. Charlie. Whiskey. No. Well, she's not here, so I don't care. <laughs> you still own her. <laughs> she's not here, she don't know. Yeah, so we are definitely... In the horse business, huh? Yep. Want to so, buy one? I sell one. I, I've yep. got them. We will, um, well, who all's up for getting out of here? Sadie? Uh-huh. Right? She's 
up to find a new home. The paint yep. is up to find a new home. Homer and Charlie, as soon as we get them broke, we're starting those next, right? Yep. So, yep. Um, the only ones that are absolutely permanent right now are who? Coop. The Bayou, Coop, Star. Yeah, that's it. And that's it. So, any of the others are looking for homes and in different phases of training, correct? Yep. All right. Anything else in, in the barn stalls? Don't start that. Let's get this because now I got your dog's head on my knee, on my leg. Like Hop up here, Randall. Thing. Jump up here. Come on. Um, all right, let's move on to in the yard farm. We did have some visitors out, right, by appointment yep. only. Uh, anything else going on in the yard farm? Don't start with that, that one thing. I was going to say, you ate my popsicle. I bought you a box of six. You should go get me one. Fine, keep talking. In the yarn it. farm, entertain. Oh, in the yarn farm? Yep. Okay, in the yarn farm, we have this. Uh, that's in the farmhouse. Oh, uh, what's in the yarn farm? Can you give me an example? Anything for the business. Oh. Um, what's been going on? We're shut down. COVID-19. We yeah, we're shut down, folks. We're going bankrupt. Uh, we're going out of business. We ain't got no business coming in, man. We are not doing it. It's going bad. It's going so, so uh, bad. Mom says it's not, though, so that's all a lie. That's just for entertainment oh, purposes I, only. Did you want to pop the cops? No, that works. So, okay. Uh, that's what I wanted. Um, okay. so, but that, that was just for entertainment purposes only, just to kill time on the camera while Mom went and get me a real popsicle. <laughs> so back to your regular <laughs> schedule. Strawberry program. bars. Okay, so uh, next up is, oh, actually, it was supposed to be mending fences. Huh. So what do we got going on in mending fences? A neighbor Gordy. came and blew everything away. Did not stop. I hope that was just for your entertainment purposes. Sorry, <laughs> folks. Um, I had to rebuild a fence out here where Gordy went through. Kept busting in the garden. Um, I put up cattle panels so much for the cute little wood thing. Not happening because he blows right through it. So I got that done. Um, anything else? You've got your truck messed around, right? Okay, you don't even have the white truck anymore. You got a different truck this week. Yep. So, and he's also got a truck payment. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, but it's a cool looking truck, is it not? Yep. Do you have a picture so on somebody, your phone you can show him? No. But if, uh, if somebody wants to buy a horse, I've got a horse. Yeah, because that's what's going to make his truck payments. Payment. Yep, yep, it's horse training. So, all right. Buy here, pay here, <laughs> buy, sell, trade, you name it. We're like a car lot for horses. Um, okay, so anything else going on in mending fences? Anything else? Everything's been pretty decent going. Okay, so in the fields. That's a big one. We've got a lot going on in the fields, correct? Because that's the garden. What's going on in the garden? This is a great popsicle. I mean, it's just good, folks. <laughs> What's going on in the garden? Mm -hmm. Right about now, I think there's two rabbits running around. They're running around about this time every evening. Okay, so I got some of the garden planted, um, and then Gordy got in there and unplanted that. So that I is had... code for he ate it <laughs> and pulled them up by the roots. Um, the tomato plants, I had actually put a cage around them so he couldn't get to them. So I still have tomato plants. The strawberries, I had a strawberry started. Gordy ate it. But I do have about five plants left out there, and there should be some others coming up, I hope. Um, bell peppers, I don't know. He bit them all off to the stem and then through the root thing, you know, because I replanted them. Yeah. So we don't know how that's going to go. But that was our big garden experiment for right now, right? What else is going on in the garden? Steaks all never tasted so good on their pre-season. <laughs> I, I know. And pre-tenderized. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because every time I was trying to work on the fence, I had to go run him off. And I got to where I was just smacking his butt with a board. Mm -hmm. just, and he'd take off about four steps, and then he'd turn and look at me, and I'd go back to work, and he'd come back over there and go rubbing on everything I was doing. Oh, it was pathetic. So, um... But what else? What's the big thing that's going on? What's in the barn that should be going in the garden? Oh, yeah, that thing. Mm -hmm. What? What's it called? It's called the... Uh, Spinning tortoise. Yeah. 
<laughs> okay, so as you know, I'm putting up a tiny house out there. The building, everything is here except the roof, correct? And as soon as the roof comes in, I have a guy scheduled to come out here and put up the shelf. So we were hoping to get it done this week, but then it what? Rained. Rained. Every time we get a chance, it rains. So, as soon as the weather breaks and I get the um, the skylights are in, it's actually the metal and it should be here tomorrow is what I was told. So, we should have everything here. I've got a trailer with everything loaded on it except for, um, I do have my locks right here. They're not on the door yet, but I got my lock and a deadbolt. And I've only given one person the key. It's like a dark brass kind of thing. Um, anyway, what do they call it? Bronze? Is it like bronze? Brass? Let me see here. Aged bronze. Bronze. Aged bronze finish. So, um, I only have given one person a key to this house. Well, it must be a really special person. Yeah, I oh, think. Cool. Who's that one person? Oh, then they're not a special person. They're a special ed person. Damn. He's got a key to it. Even though the doors aren't in place yet, and neither is the locks, and there's no walls, but he can get in. No, no joke, folks. <laughs> the trusses are still in the barn. Everything's loaded on the trailer. I just have to get it down there and have time for that uh, for our guy to come in and get it put together, correct? Mm -hmm. He said, honestly, if he has all the stuff, he should be able to get it up in two days. Who knows? So, um, if he has three people with him, maybe it'll go up faster. It just depends on everything. So, anything else going on out there in the field? Okay. In the farmhouse. We've obviously been COVID-19ing it. Oh, you haven't seen? I have an awesome one. <laughs> Yo, pacifier. It's a minion. Oh. The little, you know... It's a minion one. Oh, I thought you had a pacifier or maybe a feeding tube. <laughs> I work with Mentally Challenged and they all know what this is. Okay? So, minions. Um, RJ's is camo. Yes. And it's I a know pouch I did not. Um, it's got a cotton filter to stop germs. Um, I did not make these. Uh, Mary did. She's a friend of mine, and we'll put a link to her Etsy shop in the bo in the bottom thing. Uh, I haven't had time because what have I been doing, son? Sleep a lot. When I'm home, but what have I been? How often am I actually home? Just a little bit more than me. You're home more than I am. You're just out there riding horses. But yeah, I've been working six and seven days a week. So this is. The first day off I've had since what in three weeks. Mm -hmm. This is uh, the, I worked the last three weeks with seven days a week. This is my first day off, so yeah, it's kind of I'm gonna say it outright. COVID sucks, but it is what it is. Um, like I said, he's got his mask with cotton filter, and I have mine with cotton filter. No, mine's upside down. Um, I have a backup one that's pinks and purples and blues, but I hardly ever use it. I just use this one. So, um, what else has been going on? I have been crocheting a shawl one at least one a week and giving it away during COVID-19. Um, all of my work neighbors have one. I leave them in a package like this, and um, I just wrote a little note with them, and it says, "Hello." This is a gift hand uh, made by a home care provider working at, and then it gives the address so that they'll know where I'm at. Um, it has more than one use, but the real job is a prayer shawl. It is yours to keep, and all I ask is that you consider taking a moment any time you can to pray for our street, our town, our state, our country, and our world. When needed, wash and hand wash cold and life flat to dry. And if you know anyone who needs to be wrapped in God's love, please don't hesitate to call. Um, and provide me with an address so I can make one and drop it off. Uh, then at the bottom it says, in view of COVID-19, it gives my name and phone number. It says, in view of COVID-19 issue, 
please feel to feel safe please know that the shot has been left in this bag for well over 48 hours but you can leave me in there longer if you like and then this is just one that i've made and i've been winging it there's no pattern to these guys okay i'm just whatever stitch hits me at the time i'm doing it okay so and i made all of them so far like a garden this pink this yellow and this green so i'm just going to show you because this thing is huge okay I mean, it's it's actually longer than the table, <laughs> but yeah, it's just whatever stitch, and I'll switch stitch, and sometimes I have to pull out to make it look, you know, but they're all this garden type theme so far. Um, I have another one that I'm going to start, but I have not started it yet, so I'm just going to shove this back in here. Uh, this one won't be given away until Thursday morning, so I have time to fold it up real pretty, put it in here. Uh, we're recording this on Monday, so it will be in the bag 48 hours long before somebody else gets it. Um, Boring! Oops, I fell asleep. My bad. Then, of course, I started, of course I did, I started my first circular shawl for myself. <gasps> Randall! Randall! It just, it just clapped on to it was going to take it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. And now I just pulled out my loop. Son of a biscuit eater. Oh, my yes, gosh. Yes, you're a biscuit eater, but you're in a large. Oh, look. Oh, what's he done? What's he done? What's he done? She got a little nervous, folks. Is this the right end? This, you mean this one? Right oh, okay. Oh, that I had started to weave in. Okay, so it's this one. Oh. I have another skein to put on here, and I haven't connected it yet. Don't droop so, it at the table, Mom. If he does, I'm actually was going to try and show him what I was making. It's my first circular shawl, and as you know, I don't do a whole lot with patterns. Well, if you touch from, it, I'll beat you, dog. Well, it went from boring to fun real <laughs> fast. Thank you, feller. <laughs> I'm sure my phone, my Thank eyes you, R-A-N-D-E-L. Yeah, you have to spell it or it'll jump up. Yeah. Okay, so... It's going to look kind of like this. And oh, this my eyes. Nice. And it'll be down back there. And I don't know how long I'm going to make it. Look, it's not even showing on camera. Can you pick that camera up, son, and show them? Okay. Please. It is up. Okay. All right, here we go. Not. Okay, so it'll be like so. It's just circular, but I don't know that I want it to come down over my shoulders. But I might, because I haven't decided if I want to put some sleeves on this. Just Start a little shaking half sleeve. It, or, do you want me to finish or not? Oh, I see you shake it. Okay, I'll shake it. I don't know what that's supposed to accomplish. Huh? <laughs> Is that not what you had in mind? <laughs> Sit up, I need that box next. Uh... <laughs> okay, and then, as most of you know, um... I've been doing a block a month. I've gone through one, two, and three. I showed you before, but here's one. It's a single stitch. This is a double stitch. All of them are nine by nine. This is a triple stitch. No, this is this a quadruple stitch. This is a shell. It's a shell. Yep. And then, um, there's this. This is a one. double stitch. No, it's not. Single stitch? Um, uh, I don't know what you call it. Stitch? It's just a it's it's a double. It, it's a combination. And see, this is another variation of the shell. Um, you've got the five, but it's more of an open shell. And then this one right here, which is really thick. Is I like this. Stitch? I was actually thinking I'd use this um, stitch for a baby blanket. That would be, like, really awesome. But anyway, so those are the six. And, yes, I have already done out of my um, scrap ones that I'm doing. I've got a blue, blue, purple, green, blue, purple, green, and then... I did these in cream colors so I can at least make them cohesive. You know, at some point I want something that's going to tie them together. Don't know what yet, but anyway, so that's my scrap ones. This is what actually comes in the kit, and I am done with those, waiting on my next kit to arrive. I hit my pillow back. So, yes. Oh, cool. There you go. Good night, folks. Um, so I have been busy working on stuff. It's just 
Um, I've been doing the garden too. I've been keeping stuff done. I mowed the front yard. RJ is okay. So this is where you're supposed to tell what's your fencing project that you're gonna be doing tomorrow. Oh, that. Hang on, let me get my let me get my face on. All right. Okay, now you got hair coming through. <laughs> okay, all right. You want me to shake this while you get ready? Here. Need a little motivation. <laughs> okay, there he is. How's my makeup? Oh, I don't have any makeup. Makeup! Makeup! I need makeup. What would you like me to make up? A story? A lie? A... That'll work. That'll work. RJ <laughs> is amazing. I know, we all know that's... That's not made up? Nope. <laughs> Alright, All right, so what are you going to be doing? Well, we're going to tear some fences down. Okay, explain to him what's going to go on. We're just going to tear this fence down. We're going to take the bulldozer to it. Bulldozer. Just kidding. We're going to take uh, this fence down up here on this pasture. There's like nine no, panels. No, we're not. Stop that. Let me get Minnie her head here. I'm going to give her a ball. Uh, okay. okay, so what's really going on? <laughs> Out on the south fence line. <laughs> what are you laughing about? <laughs> I, was so, I just started like... <laughs> just kidding. This is what we're really going to do. We're going to take these nine panels down and I'm going to stretch up some real fence across here. Okay, and then you come in the yelling, day. no we're not, no we're not. Well, because I heard what you were saying before I left, and then I went out to get Minnie her cut. And, and you just assumed I continued on with this yes, I did. bulldozer she just plan. Spit it out. Look, she wants it. I'm not putting it back in when it's slobbery. You eat it yourself. She mad. No, she is, because she accidentally spit it out, and it's nasty to go have to put it back in. <laughs> You're going to go put it back in? Not my cow. <laughs> okay. You better eat it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Minnie's learning to graze. Yeah. Alright, so we're going to take these nine panels now. We're going to stretch up some more. Uh, what it is, it's the fence line between the cattle and the sheep, correct? Mm -hmm. That leads out to the big pasture. And part of it's cattle pen. We pieced it together when we did it. Mm -hmm. So you're going to take down the cattle panels. Mm -hmm. This week, what did you do in preparation for that? Had Dad picture. set a post. Tell them about this fence post you went and got. It's a big post. That dad kept hitting them and breaking. Twenty-five dollars for a post. You sent me time to get a post. I came back with. And a I post. said I wanted a solid post. I I cannot say he has not done what I asked him to do. But you would wreck a truck with this post. I think it's part of a telephone post. <laughs> to be honest with you, it's no. like. It's not part of a telephone pole. It's a fence post. It came out of a tree. No, I think it's part of a telephone pole. Anyway, so it's huge, and you said it. And then I it's a two-man post to pick up, okay? Like, uh -huh. I put it on the ground, and Dad put it in a tractor and drove it out there. Um, I uh, went and bought a roll of woven wire so we can put it up, and then I got a roll of barbed wire so we can run a, a strand of barbed wire to keep the cattle and horses from pushing in like they have been. Yep. Correct. Then what are we going to do with those nine panels? Uh, we're going to tear down the fence on Mom's garden and put up some panels. My thing is, is I don't want Gordy in there. And so what we haven't showed you is the part other than that. Um, there's this beautiful door. It's a French door. It's nothing fancy, but it's got the little crisscrossy things. And it's pretty much almost all window, correct? Mm -hmm. And that's because we're putting in three skylights. And the door is also going to be a main source of light. So... It faces the west all day long. We should be able to get light in there. And I'm just going to put shears up so that um, it doesn't get too bright. But if Gordy gets in the garden, what's going to happen to my door, son? Probably going to walk right into it. Mm -hmm. He'll tear it up. So we're going to take down, I think I figured up it was going to take, what, seven cattle panels mm -hmm. to do the rest of that. Um, and then... Uh, the woven wire will be out there. And what else do we have for the woven wire? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, dude. We have enough woven wire to do what? This fence over here on the old highway. Yes. Or not the, the gravel In road. The north end of the pasture. Yeah, it's pretty rough. It's bad. We, rough, haven't, rough, rough. we haven't done anything to it in literally years, correct? Yeah. And Gordy's pretty hard on fences as it is. Fences, gates, 
You he's, name it. Plants. He weighs like 800 pounds. I mean. But he's not big enough to, to go to the no. butcher, is he? We need to call and get a date because they're like out into August now. Okay. And he should be ready by then. Well, if he's not, he's going anyway. <laughs> Just saying. She wants to get rid of him. No. Where's he going? We named him Gordy after the Gordon Fisherman because he's going in our freezer. Mm -hmm. He's the calf with the blown up knee. Um, remember that we feel that every animal has a purpose regardless of their life. He has a blown up knee. He can't mount anything to breed. So therefore he's pointless to have around for that. So he was uh, castrated. Um, because of the way he walks, he can't be a big pet, can he, son? Nope. What happens if he tries to walk around the kids? He'll kick them. He kicks them because he has to kick that leg out. So it's just not safe. So he literally is having a really good life to feed us. Right? Get that tongue in your mouth. If, if you don't want it in there, nobody else wants it out here either. <laughs> anyway. So, um, he's been, he's going to get done. You're making our camera go out of focus, dude. You're not going to sleep on me. Come on. I know. We need to hurry it up so I can get to bed. Come on. Quit. What else is, come on. And you've been roping. Come on. Yep. Okay. So, we've talked about Gordy. We've talked about my knitting and crocheting. Um, anything else going on? What have you been doing? Because mm. last time we podcast, there was a fly. <laughs> <laughs> Last time we podcast, there I were that. no that rodeos. Cool. That was funny. Um, there were no rodeos. Now what's going on? I'm um, opening back up. Okay. They had a couple. They've been really, really. Now really they big. had rodeos or ropings. And they've had some jackpots, just ropings. Mhm. Mm just. Ropings. I entered a rodeo for next weekend. First one I've been to in a couple months. Yep. Be so. fun to crack back out. You know, get going. Yep. So. so. He's excited to do that. You've gone on a couple of cattle working for Eddie and your uncle, right? A cattle working expeditions. Yep. I'm a pioneer. Yep. So, anything else? Get off me. I'm hot, sweaty, and you stop it. Come on. Is there anything else we're forgetting? There's that thing. Yeah, go with that thing. All right. See, some things never change. Yeah, have you ever noticed that? I think they, they have. just never but... change. No, they don't. Yeah. No, they don't. There's that thing that I saw the other day. We were going to talk about it. Do Tell me that? about it. Um, it's this awesome color. It's like purplish. It's kind of little, but yet kind of big at the same time. Um, so it has some wheels. Um, it doesn't have a motor. It doesn't have tires either. It just got the wheels and you know, the metal part. It needs some tires. Um, Is this a dream for you? <laughs> to live in your own little world? I was just doing some random thought. <laughs> Seeing what I come up with. But it's not making much sense to me either. And I'm getting kind of lost. So I think I need to pull back in here and shuffle my cards up real quick. Hang on. Yeah, that one thing when he said purple. Ah, all right. All right here, here we go. I'm thinking of a thing. Okay. Well, it's not a game to think of a thing. Is there anything that has to go on the podcast kind of thing? Oh. I have been working anywhere from, I think my last clock in and out was 78 for last week. And there was one week I worked up to almost 120. So, um, yeah, COVID-19 is just kicking people's butts, correct? Seven days a week. And just before anybody says that there's not that many hours in the day, remember I do sleep houses, so I have a staff bedroom, and I actually sleep at some of the houses that I get paid to do. So, yes, I spend the night mm. at someone else's house in my own bedroom and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. Right? Find you special. So, anyway. All right, so what's that one thing before we go? Right. This is going to be a short one. We're only at like 28 minutes and normally we ran a lot. We're just right. hot. Oh, I know I am. Look at me. I mean, folks, listen. Look at me. Just okay, that's not hot. <laughs> just saying. That hurt my feelers. 
Oh yeah, baby, you're so hot. I think not. Hey. Well, I'm sorry I fell asleep. No. Uh, and you can't about? see through these. Not worth a darn of them. I know. <laughs> like, I, mean, I can get a little bit of a view over here. It's, like, uh, but not it's because of the pocket that's for the cotton. And so yes. you can't really and see. And I can't see anything over here. Like, I mean, that's because that's his blind side. <laughs> yeah, I, I can't see much over okay. here. Okay, so now we're not panicking about COVID-19. But if you were to get it, son, would it, wouldn't it be very serious for you? There's a possibility of it. Yeah. Because of his lung damage and his asthma and all that stuff. And because it attacks the lungs, it could be serious. So I wear mine at work. He wears his when he comes in. He doesn't wear it out here just regularly. But if there's somebody who comes for a visit, he puts it on. Uh, and you have used your other pink one. What's your other one? Oh, hey. my little bandana. I wear it in the wintertime because it's warm. Yep. But it's hot pink with brands all over it. So, all right. Anything else going on? Come on. Oh, Speed bright up. lights, the bright lights. Okay, the what bright else? Lights. They're so bright. Y'all have seen everything I'm working on. I oh. did want to get some spinning done, but that doesn't look like it's going to happen today because I had to get the mowing done and then we had storms and that's why Randall's going crazy. Mini, mini! Are you going to get up and show them? Come here, Randall. Come here. Come on. Get off her knees. Come on. I think she's sleeping and we're disturbing her. Come here. He's already tipped. He's Come right on. here. Yeah, I know, but he was underneath me. Alright. Come on. Alright, hop up here. Come on. You gotta get up here. He's, he's like, I'm too big. There you go. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> he's a junky monkey. Oh, son. He's too big. No, he's not. No, he's not. Yeah, okay, he is. If I wasn't holding his butt on. Okay, here we go. Look at how big All he's right. got. Or RJ's pinching under his arms. Now quit. I've got him. He can still fit in my lap, folks. See? <laughs> he's no. He's having none of it. He's like, let me down. <laughs> oh, and there just went the whole table. And there went the plug in. Hey. You lord butt. Hey, make sure that that's still plugged in to the wall. Okay. Somebody's been eating too much dog food. Hey, you. You need to lose a few pounds. No, he didn't. He's healthy. He's doing fine. But he is big. Moose! We have okay, we're done. Here. We're done. We have Moose in here. We've got Randall in here. We've got Minnie in here. we got this one trying to go to sleep on me. I'm hot, sticky. Gonna go take a shower. I'm going to bed because i got to get up and go to work tomorrow. <laughs> I don't get to stay home all the time like you do. I have to work at home. But I can't wait for the building to go up and us get to get some pictures of that up. And then, um, oh, my globe. I changed the battery in my globe that was uh, I thought we were done, folks. We are. We are. We'll do it next week. It's it's. Yeah, it's beautiful. just a it's little a thing. Beautiful. It's not it's a... Cute. Hey, no, it's beautiful. It's not that big of a deal. Right. It's just a little ball that lights up. You think she's it's part cat? It's a casing cat? ball. You it's think it's, she's part cat the way Bye, she's guys.